From the world's largest statue in the middle of nowhere in India, to an identical replica of Paris in China, and from this incredibly unique Earth sphere, to the world's largest structure that was stolen. Here are some of the world's most bizarre megaprojects. Number 5. Tan Duching in China Generally speaking, imitation is the sincerest form of flattery. However, this may not be the case for a number of China's less innovative construction projects. There are several copycat towns and buildings in China, including reproductions of Venice, London, and a White House. People who reside in these communities view them as a blend of the world's finest offerings, which they can enjoy without leaving China. Tan Duching, often known as Sky City, is one of these imitation cities. Tan Duching is modeled after Paris, complete with a 108-meter-tall Eiffel Tower replica. China also replicated several aspects of Paris, such as the lampposts and the placement of the vegetation surrounding the central tower. When it opened in 2007, the development was intended to house 10,000 inhabitants. However, as of 2013, there were just approximately 2,000 residents. Due to its remote position just outside of Hangzhou, the town was essentially abandoned. In spite of this, the imitation city's population has steadily expanded in recent years, and more and more people are moving there. To meet the increased demand for housing, new complexes have been constructed. A metro station is anticipated to open in Chiang Duching in 2022. This should increase the city's popularity and reduce its isolation. Future China will avoid undertaking these copycat projects. In 2020, new restrictions will prohibit certain foreign architectural styles. They wish to move away from replicating famous locations and instead highlight their own distinctive Chinese culture. Number 4. Statue of Unity This memorial statue is the world's tallest, standing 240 meters above Gujarat, India. The monument represents the prominent Indian historical figure Balabhai Patel. For reference, this statue is 110 times taller than the typical person. However, how does it compare to other megaprojects? It is six times as tall as the 38-meter-tall statue of Jesus Christ in Rio de Janeiro, more than 2.5 times as tall as the 93-meter-tall Monument of Liberty, and still much taller than the Spring Temple Buddha in China, the second tallest statue in the world. Each foot of the Statue of Unity measures around 70 feet, Given that the average shoe size for males in the United States is around 10.5, his shoe size would be 80 in the United States or 352 in the European Union. This monument is so tall that it is visible from 7 kilometers away. There are a museum, an exhibition space, memorial gardens, and an observation deck within the structure. Three of the five zones within the monument are open to the public, while the other two are maintenance sections. Approximately 15,000 people visit the monument daily. Due to copper oxidation, the Statue of Unity will gradually become green over the following 100 years. Despite its current copper-red hue, this is exactly what happened to the Statue of Liberty, which was originally copper-colored. The enormous monument is designed to depict Vallabhai Patel, India's first independent home minister. He successfully united all 562 princely kingdoms in pre-independent India earning him the monument and a tribute from his people. The work of the Statue of Unity began in October of 2013. Three miniature models were made to refine the design, which was altered three times before being accepted. The approved model was subsequently scanned with 3D technology and shipped to Chinese companies. These manufacturers would be in charge of casting the huge copper plates that would form the statue's exterior. China was the only country with large enough facilities to do this casting. The components were then sent overseas and assembled in a nearby warehouse as they awaited the statue's installation. Together, 3,000 laborers and 250 engineers made the Statue of Unity a reality. Similar to a skyscraper, the monument incorporates two 250-ton mast dampers for additional safety. These dampers enhance structural stability. Due to these and other safety precautions, the monument can resist winds of 180 km per hour and earthquakes of magnitude 6.5. The total cost of the statue's construction, including all safety precautions, was 27 billion rupees or $422 million US dollars. It was opened on Patel's 143rd birthday, October 31, 2018. Number 3. Dubai Frame 
The world's tallest picture frame sits 150 meters above Zabiel Park in Dubai. This glass, aluminum, and steel building serves as a link between the past and the future, highlighting where Dubai has been and where it is headed. It has a museum, an observation deck, and an exhibit predicting the future of the United Arab Emirates in 50 years. It was constructed to emphasize Dubai's opulence. In 2019 alone, nearly 17 million people visited the frame in Dubai, making it a famous tourist attraction. In 2013, construction of the frame commenced. The central glass observation deck was erected on the ground between the towers before being hoisted and positioned between the towers. On the outside, laminated glass panels form a golden ring pattern that resembles the emblem for the World Expo 2022, which is being hosted by Dubai. The museum inside the frame examines the past of the United Arab Emirates. Visitors are transported through time and arrive at the future of Dubai virtual reality display. Here, they watch a wind-powered future metropolis with flying automobiles, drum delivery, countless new mega-projects and other technological advances. In 2009, when ThyssenKrupp announced a contest to build a retroactive elevator for Dubai, the Dubai frame concept was conceived. The objective was to construct a one-of-a-kind elevator tower that would allow tourists to travel to the top and view the city from above. Fernando Donis's design for the Dubai frame was selected as the winner from a pool of more than 4,600 competing architects. The construction of Donis is based on the golden ratio. This ratio is the norm for structural stability and aesthetic appeal in architecture and the arts. It is evident in structures like the Great Pyramid of Giza and the Parthenon. The frame is a flawlessly designed golden rectangle. While he was awarded the prize money for winning the competition, he claims Dubai never paid him the entire sum for the completion of his project. Unfortunately for him, his case will not proceed since Dubai provides its self-protection from the issue. Dunnis claims his intellectual property rights have been breached, and that the frame is the largest stolen structure in history. Number 2. Beijing Daxing International Airport Beijing Daxing, located on the border of Beijing and Langfang in the Abai province, is the second international airport serving the capital. This airport features the biggest single-building airport terminal in the world, measuring almost 97 soccer fields. The proposed international airport may accommodate up to 200 million people per year at its peak. If it reached this capacity, it would be the busiest airport in the world. Face recognition is utilized in the check-in process to assist with the volume. Passengers may not be required to wait in huge queues or interact with receptionists in order to board their aircraft. This is because the airport intends to employ robots to assist passengers as they navigate the terminal. Beijing's original airport, Beijing Capital International Airport, reached passenger capacity in 2012. The initial design was stretched to its limits, yet demand continued to increase, consistently increasing by around 5% each year. The existing Beijing Capital Airport required expansion. Beijing Daxing International Airport started construction in December of 2014. The first proposal envisioned nine runways and 600,000 additional employment for Beijing residents. It took five years to finish the structure. During this period, 11 villages were evacuated to make way. While the airport's design is incredibly unusual and intriguing, it also serves a function. The airport was created by architect Zaha Hennid with beauty and functionality in mind. The courtyard in the center area is a key meeting space for travelers and their families. However, the spoke shape also lets passengers to reach their flights more quickly. From the security checkpoint to any gate is simply approximately eight minutes away on foot. In addition, the design expedites travelers' entrance and exit from the airport. The spokes expedite aircraft parking and retrieval hence reducing the time spent in the airport. Instead of the nine planned runways, the airport only has five, four of which are for civilian use and one for military use. Due to the airport's highly efficient architecture, it can still accommodate over 300 takeoffs and landings per hour. Getting to the airport by train is also not difficult. Beijing Daxing is traversed by the Daxing Airport Express, a high-speed rail route. The subterranean rail system is reinforced by more than 1,000 anti-shock cushions to lessen train vibration and keep people above oblivious. And if that wasn't enough, the airport also features a rainwater-fed artificial lake. Rainwater is collected by six pools and stored in an inner canal. 
After filtration and purification, the water is reused in the airport's water features, such as the lake. In 2020, the airport serviced 16 million passengers, and this figure is increasing. The cost of the government was around 80 billion yuan, or 11.4 billion dollars US dollars. What about the old airport, though? The Beijing Capital International Airport remains operational. Many high-capacity airlines, including the majority of China's Sky Team Airport Alliance, are switching to Beijing Daxing. Sharing the passenger burden has provided much-needed respite to the aging airport. Number 1. MSG Sphere in Las Vegas Las Vegas is often referred to be the entertainment capital of the world, and the new MSG Sphere exemplifies this moniker. Currently under development, the Madison Square Garden Sphere is a new concert and entertainment venue. The spherical will be 112 meters tall and 157 meters wide at its widest point, making it the world's biggest sphere. The arena will have 17,500 seats for concerts, performances, and other forms of entertainment. It will utilize motion, music, sights, fragrance, and temperature to totally engage audience members. On the visual side, the MSG Sphere will have the world's biggest LED screen, which will wrap around the audience to create a completely immersive experience. The outside will also be composed completely of screens, which will allow the sphere to turn into anything pedestrians see, including holiday decorations, activities within the sphere, or even the earth. The MSG Sphere is designed to be the largest and most immersive Las Vegas entertainment venue. In July of 2019, the foundation was broken and development on the basement began. The facade of the sphere was finished in June 2021, and internal construction commenced in August 2021. Officials anticipate that the sphere will open in 2023 to crowds, seeking awe-inspiring entertainment. When it opens, the MSG sphere will likely cost a total of $1.8 billion USD. According to you, which of these mega projects is the most peculiar? Let us know in the comments down below. Thank you for watching, and we will see you in the next video.